I'm here with Ashlyn and Team Miley. The fans got to choose your song tonight. How do you think they did? I think they did pretty amazing. You know, they were spot on with choosing a song that showed my personality. Mm -hmm. And that was my biggest thing in this performance, you know. It wasn't about just about the vocals and it wasn't just about like, you know, the song. It was mm -hmm. truly about my personality and who I am as an artist and who I am back home aside from all the craziness on TV, you know. Like, I really wanted people to see Ashlyn Craft in her, like, natural state, so. Exactly. It's like there's L.A. Ashlyn and then home Ashlyn. You got to show that. Yeah, fried chicken and cold beer and <laughs> all of that good me. stuff. And I love the outfit. Thank you. It's so Miley, right? Yes, she, I absolutely love she, it. This was her idea with all the fringe, and so like it, it just. <laughs> I love it. Stars, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Yeah. What did Miley tell you going into this week? What was her piece of advice for you? She just said, make sure you stay true to yourself, and like I just said, show your personality through the song because I really think that's what people wanted to see this week, and I feel like you know that's what they got because mm -hmm. this song made it so easy for me to show who I really was absolutely and you kind of still made it your own a little bit yeah. you guys have to do that do you feel a pressure to do that um honestly I think that's just something that kind of happens like um unless you think about it too much you know I feel like it has to be the medium of making it different but not unrecognizable right. and that's that, that was my struggle with this song is that it was such it is such a well-loved mm -hmm. song in the country community mm -hmm. and it was a big hit when it first came out it's still a big hit now like they still play it over and over and over on the radio so mm -hmm. I wanted to make it different but not too different to where people was like that did not sound like that right. song that I Absolutely. love you know I wanted to, people to be like okay I love that song and I love that little twist she mm -hmm. put on it so it worked out I love it you have a week of live shows in your belt how are you feeling at this point I am feeling so accomplished. You know, I did not know what to expect coming into live shows, but it has been so rewarding just to stand on stage and make it through that first week. And so I'm really hoping that this week I make it through another week. Okay, so if you have, if you make it through, which I have a pretty good feeling, it's going to be fine. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. <laughs> what do you have planned? Anything um, you can share? I am hoping this, this next round to kind of show a little softer side. Okay. So fingers crossed. So we have sassy and then soft. Yeah, because I feel <laughs> like, you know, this whole time people have gotten to see that rough, edgy side of me. And um, so I'm really hoping that next week I'm going to get Get a chance, the chance to a song that's like a little bit more of like a ballad or something slower and more like meaningful because I feel like that's something that people haven't really seen it from me yet. So fingers crossed, fingers crossed. I think it's gonna work out. It was so nice chatting <laughs> with you. you.